Hello, I'd like to show you some of the more advanced features of iGEL's Universal Management Suite. First thing we're going to do is we're going to show you how to create a profile. A profile could be used to deploy to a number of devices. This could be all of the device in your estate or could be one or two. For that process is right click the profiles folder and choose new profile. You need to give itself a name and then you need to optimize it for the particular firmware and operating systems that you're using. So in this instance, we're going to keep it as the default and select OK. What I'm going to quickly show you is how simple it is to create a Zen desktop session. So from within the profile, select Sessions. From the Sessions tab, select Appliance Mode. On Appliance Mode, select Enable Citrix Zen Desktop. Select the server that you need to deploy it to and select Save. So the next feature I want to show you is how to create a view. Basically a view is the same as asset management, so you want to try and find out what you've got out there on the estate. So from this again, we do a right click, create a new view, type the name of the view, select Next, and then create the criterion that you're looking for. In this instance, we're going to go for IP address. Select Yes. I'm going to put a range for the IP address in there. Select Next and then Finish. What that's now going to do is going to scan the database and it's going to pull back any devices you've got on that IP range. In this instance, you're seeing the device that we've already added in. The next feature I'm going to show you is how simple it is to create a job to say shut down a device, reboot a device, or you want to wake it up, or to do a firmware update. What I'm going to show you now is how to create a job for a firmware update. So we'll give it the name firmware update, choose a command we want to do is we're going to say update on shutdown, select the time you want to do the shutdown, and we come down into the scheduled job. This is where we can now say that we want to schedule that job for whatever day of the week we want, even excluding any public holidays that are out there. The final part of it is to actually assign. When we say assign, we mean it could be assign a group of thin clients or an individual thin clients. In this instance, we're going to select the device, select OK, OK, again, and now we've got a job there which will run a firmware on shutdown. Another great feature of the management software is the ability to enable your help desk staff to view remotely a user's screen. To achieve this, select the device they need to view, select shadowing, connect to that device, they're now seeing the user's device, so any error messages, issues that are occurring, there's no need for them to actually go and visit the screen. Everything's done remotely. To download your free copy of the Universal Management Suite, please visit igel.com.